Hi guys, my name is MJ. Welcome to Virtu Toys channel. This time around, I want to show you guys a recent release from Era Car. Uh, they are Lexus uh, LC500 and also the Nissan GTR R35, um, which I believe these are. That's why I have all four of them here. Um, I believe they are actually a re-release, a second, a second release. Uh, so we'll check. We'll do a quick check on the uh, what are the differences between the old one and the new one, and. Um, uh, this is this is another one that came together with it uh, within the same um, pre-order the Lexus LC 500 racing star performance um, I've already covered the regular um, The stock version of the LC 500 uh, How many colors are there? I think four or five. I can't recall how many colors. I'll put a link in the description uh, below You can check that out. However, the other one that I didn't cover right, is actually the Liberty Walk body um, The slightly newer one and uh, if I'm not mistaken, right, actually, it has uh, four colors. All right, so this is the one. I already have it out of the box. Um, this one, because I display it over at Collector's Cube. Um, they're on Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, so you can look them up. Um, I do have extra extras, a couple, a couple of extras of these. Um, so if you want to purchase, they do ship worldwide as well. You can actually check them out. Um, okay, so what I was talking about, right, actually, yeah, I do have uh, the dark blue... Sorry, the dark black, the pearl white, okay, and then the metal silver, and the metal red, okay, and the metal red. So, four colors uh, <clears throat> that I have right now. I can't recall in total how many are there. I think, I think there are four. I can't recall any of the other colors, but somehow, I don't think just four. Uh, so probably this will be the fifth one. I'll try to do an update uh, on uh, on uh, in the description as well. I'll go and check it out uh, after this video. Um, while it's uploading, I'll, I'll just do a quick check. And uh, you can actually check out the description for any other updates. Okay, uh, so this would be probably the fifth one. Racing Star Performance. I did a quick search. I don't see... I don't see the real car. Okay, I, I don't see a real LC500 in this livery. So... I'm not sure if this is actually a collaboration uh, model that they want to do with uh, Hankook. Okay, so uh, overall, very, very nice uh, body actually. Very, very nice casting from ERA. Uh, white body. The only thing I, I didn't quite like is see how I try to pull it out, right? Yeah, <laughs> that's all the, the all the way the wheel goes. So it's not flush with the, uh, the white body, so it does look quite odd. However, it's screw... On revert so it's quite easy to do a wheel swap okay and then you would notice this here right that is actually the rubber uh, the rubber tires I think there are some extras that uh, probably I need to cut it out yeah this one I think it's an easy fix I just need to cut out the extra bits there, there. you can see the extra bits right okay so the best part about era is that the opening parts all right the opening doors um, and also the opening hood so this time around, this one is not too tight. It's quite easy for me to, to just open it up. And uh, okay, I do see some. Mm. So this one is already out from the box uh, on display already because yeah, I uh, <laughs> there's so many arrivals in, in the past couple of weeks. Uh, so it's, it's just really very difficult to catch up um, with the unboxing sessions and also, you know, doing YouTube videos. So um, quite a few of, of the newer models, right? We have already unboxed it and uh, displayed. Okay, so actually, I do quite like this uh, dark gold and black combination. That is actually very nice. Okay, Rock Racing Star Performance. I did a quick search. I, I can't find, uh, I don't see much, no, I don't see any information on uh, Racing Star Performance. Uh, however, it has a Hankook logo. So, probably based on a real car. Uh, if you do know, if you if you have a link to a picture of the real thing, or if you do know any story about the real car, let me know. Okay, let me know in the comment section below. Cool. All right. So maybe I'll get back to this a little bit later. We'll see if it if there's enough time. Maybe we'll open it up, right? Or I'll do it in another video. Um, then uh, still talking about the LC five hundred, right? So this is actually the previous release. That's number sixty two that I have uh, at the back there. Okay. I'll just move it up a little bit. No, zoom out right that's better so this would be a stock body now this one definitely looks uh, in a way the fitment right the way the wheels are uh, is flushed is, is aligned to the body um, definitely looks better than the white body version so 
Yeah, I think I think the the white body version that needs a wheel swap. I think if we do the wheel swap, probably it's gonna look better. All right, and uh, oh, the tailpipes. I just noticed the difference. Okay, <laughs> all right, the tailpipes are different. Um, still quite nice so far. So far, only two brands that I know is that did, did this LC five hundred. Um, there's the other brand, uh, Master, but I haven't. I got it out of box, but uh, it's uh, quite far away for me. So. If you want me to do a comparison, let me know in the comment section below, okay? Then I'll do a comparison for you guys. Um, let's see if I can try to open it up. Because I've I've, I've uh, opened this before, it's basically the same um, details as the, 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 the Liberty Walk version. Right, so uh, my main thing is actually I want to I want to do a comparison, right? So first things off the bat, it will be the packaging. Um, the old one is a regular era packaging, number 62. This one has a special uh, to Toshigi police model. All right, so um, yeah, packaging is a little bit different. All right, so that that's packaging, and same it comes with a figure. So yeah, it's basically the exact same figure. Now this one also I already have it out of the box. So the most obvious difference on the car, right, is actually the siren. Um, the newer version somehow it's faded, a little bit softer red compared to to the previous version. Um, the previous one has a darker red. I think that it's a little bit more realistic. Okay, and um, I already have the figure sitting inside. <laughs> okay, all right. So this one, um, I don't have the figure sitting inside, but I have it with me here. I can show it to you. Uh, basically, they are the same. Uh, yeah, I think that that's that's basically that's it that I can tell you. Um, hang on, let me see. Oh, no. Okay, just open up the door and she fell off. Let's see, since I got it out. Okay, so yeah, it's slightly different. So pardon me, I thought they are the same. They are not. They are not the same. Um, she does look, I, yeah, I don't know if it's male or female. <laughs> but same position, the uh, same uh, posture. But uh, this one has a batch on the shoulder. While the previous one doesn't have that. Probably this one is a closer um, representation, probably yeah, a closer representation of the police uniform in uh, that particular police station. The Toshigi police force, probably, huh? probably. Okay, so this would be the previous one and then this would be the, the latest. So this one I have here would be the latest uh, version. Okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna put it on the side because I remember it's it's a little bit of a challenge trying to put it in because the the doors don't open very wide and uh, the figures are just nice oh okay so this one I think it's easier to to fit her in her or him yeah I don't know okay so I'm gonna try to do that for this one as well let's see I'm guessing this one's not too difficult I think this is easier than the GTR I guess because I remember struggling with the GTR version. Yeah, I got her in, but uh, she's not, she, he is not exactly in position, but we'll adjust that later. Um, I'll just leave it there. Car-wise, I think everything is pretty much the same. Um, I Oh, there is a, a label on the bottom as well. Um, so you can see which is the newer version and the older version. The, this is 2021 and this is 2022, Hong Kong design. But basically everything else looks identical just you know probably from a different batch of um, cars different batch of paint um, so the colors is a slightly just a slight different slightly different um, but yeah basically you can call it the same um, of course the 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 finish talking about the car actually with the car come with one more accessory okay there's one more accessory that I will show you guys in a short while but before that I want to talk about the GTR first um, same thing, packaging wise, previously it's number 35, this was released quite some time ago. Um, right, yeah, quite some time ago. And uh, this one is basically old packaging, it doesn't show you the picture of the figure that it actually came with the figure. So this one has the figure photo underneath, okay, that's the Toshigi uh, GTR. Alright. Hang on, let me open it up because I already got it out of the box. All right, so same thing. The difference, right, with the siren, especially that's the most obvious difference. Um, you can see. Sorry, let me just focus. Uh, there we go. 
You can see this one is a little bit more faded. This is the newer version, okay? Compared to this, this will be the, the first edition, if, I'm, if I can say that. Um, let's see, engine detail, basically they are identical. Probably, you know, again, a different batch of um, paint. Hang on, let me just zoom in and here we go. Probably a different batch of paint. So one, somehow the new one kind of, no, I think they're the same. They are the same. So the plates are the same as well. Um, headlamps, yeah, the, the first version headlamps kind of fade a little bit. Uh, the newer one is clearer. So it comes with a figure. Figure is basically the same. Uh, mine is still in the box, I'll get it out. So the other difference would be the disc brake, the disc caliper. Okay, so the older version has the yellow caliper on top. Okay, the yellow caliper. The newer version has the red caliper. Um, uh, both look looks as good, I guess. So basically, very identical. Yeah, very very identical. Okay, all right. So same, both can open doors. Uh, both comes with a figure. This one, it's thing. The figure is still in the box. Let me just do a quick check. It should be in here. I didn't check before the video. Yeah, it's still in here. Okay. Alright, I remember I had quite a bit of a struggle trying to put her in because the, the this GTR version, the doors don't open that wide. I just want to check if it's uh, similar to the Lexus figure. Yep, yep, I guess that's a batch. Can you see? Yep, that's a batch on her shoulder. Alright, so I would assume the, in the, the first edition, the first version didn't have that batch on her shoulder. Yeah. No, so slight difference on the figure as well. Okay. All right, so that's the cars. However, the other other biggest difference, right, with uh, these two police models, right, would be this. Okay, I, I, I think I'll probably need to, I'll probably need to move the camera, move my phone. This guy, hang on. I'm gonna hold it <laughs> a little bit better. Let's see how I can uh, put it further away. This is quite big actually. And uh, this is actually a freaking pillow. Uh, it is quite big. Um, but I think <laughs> one of the reasons why I, I, I decided to get this right, I think I'm gonna keep one for myself. Um, I think this is quite nice to put in the car. <laughs> if I'm ever if I'm ever stopped by the by the police, right? Don't know. I guess this maybe will help me help me help me uh, make our conversation a little bit more lighthearted. <laughs> this is nice actually. Um, material wise, wait, hang on. I thought I saw a zip. Yep, it's zipped, so you can actually uh, remove it and uh, you know take it to wash or, or, or whatever. Or you want to change the casing? Probably next time. Probably next time. You know, error can come up with just the casing and then. <laughs> you can buy you can buy additional casing for the pillow. This is the GTR version, okay? That is actually the hang on. I'll show you. There, this one I haven't got it out of the, 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 the plastic. Okay, so this one is the Lexus version. Nice right, I think it's okay. I think it's not bad. Quite an idea. So not just uh figures, not just having additional figures for your uh era cars, you can have a pillow now. <laughs> Quality wise actually it does feel quite premium. Um, it's not some it's not some cheapo, you know, uh, kind of material. It it feels uh, rough. Um well when I say rough right, you can hug it, it's quite comfortable, but rough as in I think it yeah, you don't have to wash it for some time. <laughs> Alright, cool. I think I'm gonna keep the, the pillow. I think I'll keep one of each. Uh, the Lexus and the GTR. What do you think? What do you think about a pillow as a as as an additional additional accessory from Era? What do you think? Let me know. I'm interested. Alright, uh what else? Let me know if you want to see the rest of the, the Liberty Walk um version of the Lexus from Era. Because only before this video I realized, oh okay, I only done the video review for the regular uh, for the stock uh, once I have not done a review video for the white body ones. Actually, overall the, the custom is actually quite nice. I'll probably I'll probably do a wheel swap on on this and uh, I'll 
put some some photos up or over on um, collector's cube social media cool all right so uh that's it for me this time around um okay so help me to hit the like button if you haven't done so because that will help me out with the youtube algorithms um hit the subscribe button hit the bell so that you don't miss on any of my other diecast videos that's it for this time around thank you so much for watching guys take care bye